Guys, really quick, I wanted to make a short video on exactly how you open the ports uh, on port 81 for your Google Cloud Platform VM instance. And the reason that we're doing this is because I want to use the proxy manager on port 81 in order to set up some SSH keys, um, but I need to open up port 81. So what you do is you are on your VM instance page, you click the drop down uh, window next to your compute engine, and then, oh I'm sorry, it's the three dots, not the drop down. You go to view network details, and at the uh, very top here, where did it go? Where did my button go? Oh yeah, on the left hand side you're gonna click firewall, and you have two buttons, create firewall policy and create firewall rule. Um, if you look down here, there's two different sections. There is the firewall rules section, and you have the network firewall policy. We don't want to worry, real worry about the network because if you opened HTTP and HTTPS ports when you were first setting up the virtual machine, you shouldn't need to worry about the network, but you do need to turn the firewall on for your uh, your virtual machine so go up to create firewall rule not create firewall policy you're going to name the policy you don't need to worry about the description you can turn the logs off on network you want to leave it at default priority just type in one in here uh, ingress allow and then you don't need to worry oh you need to press all instances in the network leave it on IPv4 and then for the source IPv4 ranges, you're going to do 0, .0, .0, .0, 0, 0.0.0.0 0. So it's 40 slash 0. You don't need to add a second filter. You don't need to add a destination filter. And then you're going to press TCP and you're going to type port 81 because that's the port we want to open for the uh, for the Nginx proxy manager and then you're going to click create. And after you've done that, the port 81 should be open. So when you go to the IP address of the uh, of your virtual machine and then port 81, it should redirect you to the login page of the Nginx proxy manager. And that is about it.